Cyclone Salida continues to intensify and is now on the verge of reaching Category 5 status with winds of 155 miles an hour, roughly 250 kilometers per hour sustained. It's at 15.5 degrees south, 57.6 degrees east as of 11 p.m. Mauritius time this December 21st. It's a stage 8 on the CDPS scale. Damage potential is catastrophic. The storm is currently moving to the south and is likely to start turning towards the southeast soon. It's 155 miles from St. Brandon, 207 from Tromeline, and 322 miles from the Mauritius capital, Port Louis. That is roughly 450 to 500 kilometers. Warnings remain the same. Class 2 warning in effect for Mauritius may be upgraded to Class 3 in the morning. Cyclone pre-alert also in effect for Reunion. Uh, the warnings will probably be stepped up at some point during tomorrow and could even reach Class 4 if the storm passes close enough. This is what we expect will happen on the model runs over the next few days. This is the GFS run showing the storm passing just to the east of the island and then off to the southeast way out of harm's way by the end of the weekend into the beginning of next week. Uh, however, some models do take the storm closer to the island of Mauritius uh, with varying results. Some models having tropical storm force winds on the island, others suggesting hurricane force winds will be felt on the eastern part of Mauritius. Uh, all remains to be seen and of course the storm could deviate away from all of those model tracks completely but that is unlikely. Sea surface temperatures though are certainly warm enough 27 or 28 degrees Celsius which is more than enough to support a storm of this strength and further strengthening to category 5 status cannot be ruled out. Over the next few days, here's another look at the wind graphic showing tropical storm force winds just on the edge of Mauritius there on the GFS, although it is worth noting that the GFS model is further east than some other models, uh, although some models do take it further east than the GFS as well. It all remains to be seen, but uh, certainly preparations should be made for tropical storm and hurricane conditions on Mauritius because the worst could indeed happen. As it stands right now though, the uh, chances for tropical storm conditions look like this. 75% in Port Louis, and that is the same in Mayaborg in eastern Mauritius. Uh, some areas will have very strong gusts, well beyond hurricane strength in exposed locations we anticipate, but most areas should be below hurricane strength gusts. This is what we expect on the models, although this is quite a delayed model run now. Um, it's gone well beyond what all of the models were saying yesterday uh, and that is pretty much due to low wind shear which has really aided the storm in the last 24 hours and it will remain low for another 24 hours or so which means further strengthening is possible in that time period. The storm's likely to make its closest approach to Mauritius on Saturday night into the early hours of Sunday morning. Here is the latest satellite imagery of the storm and it's been presented, presented even better in the last few hours. This loop goes around 12 hours and you can see the eye becoming even more well established in those latest frames and Category 5 is certainly within this storm's reach in the next few hours. We'll wait and see whether its intensity holds but regardless of that it's a very strong storm. 250 km per hour sustained winds, much higher gusts and it's heading for Mauritius. We'll have more updates starting at 6am Saturday morning on the Force 13 channel. You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website force13.com. You can also find our YouTube channel if you're not there already. You may well be. Good chance of that. Subscribe if you haven't. You can also find our Facebook page, search Force 13 all in text, and our Twitter handle, it's at Force 13 on there. You can also help the project become even better by becoming a patron. You can see more information about all the benefits involved by visiting patreon.com forward slash force13. Of course, you can come into direct contact with us by uh, messaging fool13 on Discord at extension 9094 and force13 on Skype. And our partners are also doing updates Mateo a Cyclo Maurice on Facebook.